The metal cap can control how long a sound lasts by the gate time setting. That's the sustain. When you step on the edit foot switch and you hit the D natural, the highest D natural, you can set how long you want that sound to last in milliseconds. So if I wanted the sound to last a half a second, I would type in five zero zero and let go. Now that sound will last for five hundred milliseconds. And you can do it anywhere from really short point zero one tenth of a second up to about six seconds. The Malacat also has a feature called roll mode. When you step on the gate time and hit the forward key, it moves over one screen and you can assign the roll mode on and off. And what that means is that if you want a sound, let's say you want to play a timpani sound or, uh, or a cymbal roll, and you don't want the Malacat to shut each note off as it plays the next note on, the roll mode suspends the note offs until after you stop playing. It's a real important feature to avoid those machine gun effects. There's also another mode on the Malacat and it's called Velocity Gate. And what Velocity Gate does is say it says that when I play soft, it's going to be one length, let's say a half a second long. And then when I play hard, it's going to be 200 milliseconds long. So that means that every sound that you play will be longer or shorter depending on how hard you hit. It makes it sound so much more musical. So in order to get that to work, you need to set the gate time to velocity. And how do you do that? By going to zero, right after the lowest number, 0 0.10, you hit the decimal key and the velocity comes up. The other way to do it that I like, let's just say you have a large number of, let's see, 900 milliseconds. I just hit the zero pad twice. You see zero and then hit the decrement once and you get to that velocity screen. I use it for almost all my sounds so that the sounds are more musical as I play. And it allows me to express myself by creating the, the sounds being longer or shorter.